Yeah, it's just the update of the wetlands. There's all this water in here is the reclamation project it's supposed to be filtering out all the toxins and that from the stormwater drains and returning the water back into the Christie's Creek. But with them pouring boulders, I guess, into the Christie's Creek and that, it's all causing blockages. That's the drain, drain cover, the, the manhole that sends you down into the pump, that pumps down into the creek. The water from over here. But as, as I pointed out earlier, there is no water in here. Can't get anything out of it to put it back into the creek because they get trucked out of here quick, quicker than they can put the water back into it. So you go for a walk down the creek and it just stinks because all the water's stagnant and not moving anywhere. So it's normally up to that second if I can point it with it, the water is normally coming up to about there, on the tree. And so to be able to walk all the way around here and everything, <coughs> it's pretty dodgy. I mean, still a bit of moisture, a bit, a bit springy, but the cracks in the ground are pretty decent. <coughs> it's just dodge water going nowhere except for the trucks. He's just stirring it all up. Come on. Oh dear. When is a black and white dog a black dog when it's covered in mud? Come on. Head off again. There's the pumping house. That's the creek itself, runs off in that direction, down towards the Southern Expressway, and eventually the sea. Uh, fuck all water's getting there, obviously. Still cleaner than the Onkaparinga River though, I reckon. It doesn't smell as bad. Still, still wouldn't want to go swimming in it. I know you probably can't see on the camera, but I can still see the bottom of the, of the lake there. I can still see all the mud going out, all the way out about there. It's like a bit of an island patch in the center there. I was supposed to be doing this to prevent environmental impacts and I don't know, I'm a bit on the fence. I, in one way, it's, I think the wetlands is helping. They keep putting water into, into it, obviously, cleaning it, and that's a, good, that's a good thing, but when there's no water too clean and it just ends up like this, like a stale, stagnant puddle of water, it's not the very best thing. I think they'd be able to find What's, what's so bad with going to reservoir and filling up from Maiponga Reservoir or something like that, you know? At least there's plenty of water in there, and here there's nothing. I mean, unless it rains, we, it's not going to fill up again, and it's going to take a little while to fill it back up. Uh, anywho, thought I'd check, check you out the wetlands while I'm on the, the dog run. Uh, might do another one on the way home. I don't know, probably not. But that's the Christie's Creek Wetlands water catchment system.